If you pray in tongues, if you have the gift of tongues, that's a, a wonderful prayer gift because we're stupid and we don't know what to say. Paul tells us in Romans, when we don't know what to say, the Holy Spirit speaks for us with sounds that we don't understand, groanings that are unutterable. And the fact that we don't understand it is good. Because our unconscious is more powerful than our conscious. We have to do something with it. We have to educate it. And repetition is a great way of educating it. And the fact that the conscious, rational, abstract understanding doesn't get in the way, that's good. Nothing wrong with either one of them, but we need both. So praying in words that you don't understand is a way of saying, God, I trust that you're the better prayer than I am, so I'd rather use your words than mine, so please pray through me and for me and instead of me.